My name is Sebastian Gonzalez, and I'm gonna be surprising my mom with the tattoo. <laughs> Honestly, we could get any number of reactions from my family. Something about tattoos just speak to me. It's dope, but they wouldn't let me get one, so. None of my family has ever gotten a tattoo. I don't think my mom's gonna be too happy. I ended up choosing a koi fish just because it fits in with the whole zen vibe of my family. I'll be getting a dragon tattoo. My mom's pretty smart, but also I really dig dragons. A little bit nervous, but at the same time, I think this is gonna be great. What kind of uh, kid was Sebastian growing up? He was such a good kid. He just was always very, um, just listen. <laughs> Very proud of you, you know? And Thanks, just... well, I'd never want to do anything that would take away from that pride that you have in me. Would you guys say that you have like a pretty open, you know, kind of relationship? Well, I want to give him his space, but I would hope that he was honest with me, you know? Yeah. Do you remember when I was like talking to the two of you about Tom's birthday, like the weekend before last? Yes. And I got a little bit heavily under the influence. Well, there's like one other thing I ended up doing that night. The real reason why I brought you here wasn't for really any of this. What? Just. You sh me, Sebastian. When'd you get that? I got it like a couple weeks ago. Your dad's gonna kill you, dude. No, mom, no. Yeah. <laughs> All right, so. Uh, oh my gosh, it's beautiful. I got a koi fish. Was it painful? Uh, I don't really remember. Yo, well good. I wanted a tattoo well, and you said you like personal space. I, I do what I want. What is it? It's like a dragon with smokes and stuff like that. It looks like scribbles to me, Sebastian. Oh, come on, now you're oh just being mean. God. I love the koi fish. It's kind <laughs> of tied in with That's what I'm Papa Ross, yeah, it's my a family. dad, yeah. who had a beautiful koi pond yep. and who actually had a heart attack right next to his koi pond. And it was the most peaceful way for him to go. It was a blessing. Do you even know, like, when you got the tattoo, like, what does it mean to you? It means strength, resilience, and that I really like Lord of the Rings, so, yeah. I don't know why I thought, you know, that you had gotten in trouble with the law or mm -hmm. you decided to go sleep with a hooker, and I was like, oh no. <laughs> so a tattoo's mild. <laughs> <laughs> I've gone through this with him before. I got a tattoo when I was 18. And now I'm, you know, 44 years old. I want to get it off. I'm disappointed. You know, at least talk to me about it. And especially that color. <laughs> wow, wow. Yeah, I've considered tattoos myself. What would you get for a tattoo? Maybe an octopus. Hmm. Thank God it wasn't a prostitute. <laughs> <laughs> Is there anything else I guess that you want your mom to know? Oh, more? Like, what else can you tell me? Oh, I mean, great. Calm down. All right, the tattoo's fake, Mom. <laughs> Let me see. Look, look, the tattoo's fake, Mom. Like, you, you could scrape it off just barely. <laughs> oh, God, thank God you didn't get it. I uh, just want to give you one last look at the tattoo. Yes. Yep, because uh, it's actually going to wash off. <laughs> it's not a real oh, okay. tattoo. Really? Yeah. You don't understand how much it was going to cost us to get that lasered off. Who <laughs> said I was going to get it lasered off? I'm shaking. I'm so happy. <laughs> It's a beautiful tattoo, though. You didn't want to go for something a little more masculine. <laughs> I, I, I want to give you a personal space, but like something like that is 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 big. You know, tagging yourself and doing that is not what makes you. You is what makes you. Um, don't get an octopus tattoo. Okay. Because I think the octopus will be a little scary. A little scary.